Listen, mate, I need to uh, splash the boots. You know, strain the potatoes. Good day, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Barry McKenzie's the name. He's got a great big grin and a great big chin. Give him half a chance, he'll be in like Flynn. His great big fist will flatten any palm. He's got a great big fist, you can do your worst. When they tap the king, he'll be in there first. Oh, it's not your younger than. Raymond, this is Barry McKenzie. Go and stick your head up a dead bear's bum. Look, Barry, seriously, I've been promising myself a trip to the old country ever since Norm's little operation. My family came from Britain many moons ago, you know. Um, hello, sir. I'm, I'm terribly sorry, but... somebody must have let that Australian lunatic on the set. Excuse me, sir. Have you the time? Sorry, sport, but point of established fact at the present period of time, me watch wrist has shaken hands with my wife's best friend. If we can't make bread out of an authentic Australian folk singer, I'll quit this racket. Idiom. Right, you chose well, sir. You chose well here. Yeah. Hey, like it? That'd be 43 guineas for this sweet. Capital idea. I'll take the boy into my den and put it up to him. Oh, no, you won't, you filthy old perv. I'll ask him. I want you to think of me as someone that you can turn towards. Yeah, from what I've heard of your mob, you won't catch me turning any other way. From the team that brought you, sir, Robert Ramsey. You know, point Percy at the porcelain. I think he wants to go to the Louvre. 